G'day everyone, Tim Richardson here, the member for Morty Alec. In Parliament House this week, uh, post some of the budget hearings that we've had for the Public Accounts and Estimates Committee, but I wanted to give you an update on the level crossing removals and soon people around the Cheltenham and Mentone and Parkdale areas will get an update in the letterbox. This one coming through very soon about the level crossing removals there. And uh, this is a very exciting time over the next 12 months with construction getting underway. But during that time, we're going to see a lot of impact from construction and that's going to be something that we'll have to work through and support each other uh, with some of the disruptions and construction going on. This update talks about the additional parking that will be provided during the construction phase. There'll be more car parking bays provided at Parkdale and then around Mentone and Cheltenham when we close those, those uh, uh, parks at Mentone and Cheltenham stations to get underway with the construction. So there'll be an impact through there, but permanent uh, parking will be provided at Cheltenham with a four-storey development of car parking there and then along Edward Street and then in Mentone we'll see about 100 bays provided in the station car park precinct and then along Como Parade uh, uh, east and um, west. So we won't see any net loss in car parking but we'll be spreading out some of that parking burden and I'm hoping to see permanent changes at Parkdale train station to allow for extra parking. Now these level crossing removals are substantial for our community. Just recently in the Victorian budget, we confirmed that the Chelsea level crossing removals, getting rid of all level crossings in Chelsea, will be part of this Victorian budget. And of course, Mentone and Cheltenham are the next ones to go, with Edafal, Chelsea and Bomb Beach soon to follow. So stay up to date with some of the news and information. You'll get that pack in the letterbox. Of course, if you've got any questions at all, hit me up on the Facebook or send me an email. Have a great week.